Hi everyone, a very quick video just to present you the Nightmare Severity Index, the NSI, a very short new multidimensional tool for assessing nightmares. Just published this uh, auto questionnaire with colleagues interested in uh, clinical practice or in research in nightmares. The idea was to have a very simple, comprehensive and multidimensional uh, auto questionnaire. This questionnaire is also free to download, free to use, both for clinical practice or for research. This uh, uh, NSI uh, has four subscores. The first one assesses the frequency of nightmares with a very simple question, which is, please estimate how often your bad dreams wake you up. The second subscore uh, assesses the emotional impact of nightmares with two questions. The first one about the emotional intensity and the second one about how often your nightmares involve vital threats to safety or physical integrity. The third subscore assesses the diurnal impact of nightmares with four questions. The first one about the impact on global functioning, the second one on mood, the third on concentration and memory during the day, and the fourth uh, about the arousal ability. The fourth uh, subscore and last one is about the nocturnal impact of nightmares with two questions. The first one about the uh, interference with uh, falling asleep and the second one about the sleep continuity. There are two uh, additional questions. One about uh, the uh, percentage of recurrent nightmares and the second one about the terms uh, of these recurring nightmares. And this is more about trauma nightmares. So uh, this is very simple. You have a total score, which is calculated using the higher score uh, of uh, in each subscores on questions with the higher score. So the maximum is 20 and the minimum is zero. The higher score you have, the more severe uh, are nightmares. So this is very simple, comprehensive, multidimensional and free to use, free to download. Uh, on uh, the uh, website of this research article, which is here indicated. Thank you, and feel free to contact me if you have any questions.